Hi everybody, so today I'm giving you a different style of video. So instead of doing a makeup tutorial, I'm actually going to do a unit update. Okay, so I'm into the whole wigs thing. I mean, I bought so many wigs. I have so many on my wish list. So I decided to go ahead and post a video about them. Now the difference between these, they're going to be updates because there are a lot of wonderful YouTube videos out there for the unboxing, you know, showing you the comb placements and different things like that. But there's not really a lot of videos on updates, like how long did the units last, what they do after a while. So that's why I'm bringing this one to you because I like to wear my wigs as long as possible before switching to a new one, especially since I use color. Now, if all my wigs were a 1B or 2 or 4, that would be different. Then it would just be like, oh, okay, she curled it differently or she has a wash and go or whatever the case may be. If we're wearing different colors, it's kind of like, wait a minute, I came in yesterday to buy this and now she has this color hair. And the whole point is to try to make it look like it's your own natural hair. So let's go ahead and get into the one month update. So I am going to be reviewing this wig that I have on now, this unit, and it is from Model Model, and this is in French Meadow, okay, and I have her in the color SP Truffle, and of course there are different other colors that she comes in, so it's kind of like a loose wave with a little flip in the front to it, you know, so you can kind of wear it to cover your eye or wear it pushed back so she's very versatile as far as what you can do with her as far as the placement of the hair and the bangs so as far as wearing this unit every day uh, after the first week she started to tangle and I found that I was surprised at that I figured because she was shorter there wouldn't be um, that much tangling but there was see the ends I've only had her on today for about an hour and a half, and she's already tangling at the ends there. So she is a high maintenance unit. Other than that though, she's beautiful. Like I love the color. It's like a blondish color. And then at the tips, it has dark brown. And see, you can see on the tips, the dark brown is getting frizzy. So I could either cut the ends off or I can use a flat iron and put some heat to it. The only thing is I don't want to change the curl pattern. So that's why I don't know if I really want to flat iron the ends right now. Um, but still, I feel like that's kind of early for her to be doing that with only a week. Because like I said, I want my wigs to last as long as possible. So if I can get a month or two out of them, that would be great. And then just switch to a different unit. Now on the weekends, though, I do use a different color because... I don't really care. <laughs> I'm probably not going to see this person again anyway. But at work, I like to kind of keep the same color, same wigs for as long as I can. But other than that, she's a gorgeous wig as far as, you know, the curl pattern, how she kind of falls into the face and you can take her out. And, you know, I love this color. I just, I don't like the tangling. So she's high maintenance. So because of that, I wouldn't wear her every day. I would just wear her for special occasions. Um, I don't mind that this isn't, really a natural color um, because a lot of hairstylists a lot of color experts they like to do different colors so I feel like this could be natural if you went to a salon I actually had someone stop me on the way outside of the mall she's like who did your hair was someone here in the mall so I mean it, it could be possible it could be a natural color that you see on somebody if they're into the kind of funky colors and experimenting and be a, being dramatic, dramatic like myself so uh, I hope you guys uh, appreciate these updates. I hope you find them helpful and uh, beneficial to you when selecting your units and whatever you're trying to go for. Like I said, it's, she's, she's, a, she's a beautiful unit. It's just be prepared to, you know, have the need to kind of brush her out every now and then because um, your hands will get stuck trying to get your fingers through there. But the tangles do come out, but I feel like they come right back. As soon as I, you know, do this, they're still there. Oh, and there is, um, you can see that there's a little bit of shedding. So she does shed. Not a lot. Not like my other unit that I wear, um, I'm currently wearing. Um, but this one does have a little bit of shedding. All right, guys. Well, until next time, I do have another review coming up. And then... Uh, next week, I plan to purchase some other units, so I'll test those out. So as I'm testing them out, I will let you know how well um, they hold up 
I do have one favorite who I want to replace. I will purchase her again and just keep repurchasing her because I love the color. And um, so I'll let you guys uh, see her on my next review. All right, thank you so much. If you have any comments, questions, suggestions, leave them down below. Don't forget to please like this video, give it a thumbs up, and also subscribe so that way you can get notifications on when I post new makeup looks or when I post new updates for the units that I'm currently wearing. All right, until next time, I hope you have a wonderful rest of the week and have a wonderful weekend. And there is another makeup tutorial that is coming up after I post this one. All right, guys, till next time. Bye.